yourselves at home. Go ahead. Hey, how are you? Man, this is great, man. I love this. See, this is nice and comfortable. Hey, it's Rap Hitfield, and I'm really excited that I'm here with Ben from Baby Convention because, you know, I love Ben, and I haven't seen him in a long time. And last time we did an interview, it was like literally over the phone. It was over the phone. Yeah. He was home. I was in San Francisco, and it was still a killer interview. Man, because whenever I talk to you, it's about it's deep. It's about music, and songs, real and real, yeah. which is the best part, you yeah. know. So thanks for having me. You know, it's so, I'm so I got so pumped when I knew you were going out again and when you were playing. So we just got together for these for a couple festivals. There was one yesterday, and we're doing incarceration today. We're stoked about it. That's then great. we'll be going out with Alice in Chains starting in August. Which, in Bush. Is, which is so great. Yeah, that's cool. I mean, two bands I grew up with, and now I'm like going to be. It's surreal. I've yeah. seen them both long before Breaking Benjamin, like attended their concerts. Yeah. And I don't go to many concerts. Yeah. So it's surreal to be on a tour like that. Yeah. yeah. That's so great because those are two bands you love. With. Yeah, and kind of like formed what we do. Yeah, know, formed our sound, Absolutely. formed us as people, which I love. It's so, so yes, yeah, so you show me around the bus a little bit, which is cool. I know you were watching Stranger, Stranger things. things. Yeah, I went back. I seen the whole thing. You know, saw the the finale and all. Now I'm going back to the beginning because it's been a while. And you know, when you're on the bus, we were we we're here in, in we're here at incarceration. There's not too much around. There's yeah. woods around, That's it, you know. So there really isn't much to do. So I just doing a little Stranger Things. Marathon. That's cool that you are. You know, you know what I like about Stranger Things. What they do with Stranger Things now too is just the way it's, it's reviving old songs like Kate Bush as well. Yeah, like that hill. Yeah, and they do such a good job at yeah. like making every little thing in it. You know, look authentic. And been from that period of the eighties. Yeah, because I'm like, I'm like kind of an eighties kid. Yeah. So I'm forty four. I was yeah. born in seventy eight. So the eighties were great for yeah. me. Yeah. Anybody that was born later than the 80s, I'm like, missed it. Yeah, missed it. So much great stuff. It was great music, great music, 80s and 90s, yeah. too, you know? Yeah. There, I mean, there's always still great music. You know? You're a big part of that as far as I'm concerned. Thank you. It's so awesome. Thank you. It's know? awesome coming from you. Yeah. Let's check it out. So there's four bucks right here, right? Good. So yeah. Great. This is like, it's not, I hate the name of it, but it's called a star coach. The star coaches are buses that have a bedroom in the back. That's all yeah. the star part is. Yeah. I hate that they call it a star coach, but that's just yeah. what it's called. Yeah, yeah, you know, like it's one of those things we're kind of like, like, I don't know. We didn't, we didn't name it. Yeah, I'm, that's right. nothing to do with me. Yeah, right. right. Cool. This is great. So this is my humble abode, my bedroom. Right. This is great. This is fun. Uh, got yeah, my Tums and water. And I just heard uh, a new version of, of by another band in Jane. So they did your, your song, and I was like, Really? Yeah. My somebody, song? Yeah. Who? Somebody just covered it. I'm going to find out when I text you. Oh, so a band band, band covered a, it? A band band covered it because it came through um, one of my countdowns where they were submitting. That's how I know I'm getting old. Dude, like, yeah. You know? What do you mean? Right. about it, right? It's grateful. You know, I was going to ask you this. You know, I love your song, right? I love. Thank you. You know, I've always loved the emotion and the things that you talk about, you know. So I wanted to ask you, like, were you writing some new stuff for me? Were you taking some time during the pandemic? Or were you doing some writing? No, it was because it's a weird time in life. So, yeah. So yeah. everybody reacted differently. Some people wanted to write. Other people were like, I'm just trying to feel with everything. I think it was very uninspiring time. Yeah. So it was hard to write. It, yeah. You know, when you don't, we're very fortunate to have, like, so much support from real people in the world and, and you know, people that are like in the industry also but we're very fan driven yeah and when you can't see them and you can't interact with them and you don't know when you're gonna see them or interact with them it's really hard to get into the mindset of like creating something that we're gonna like share yeah it's just lonely time yeah. you know we're all all of us were quarantined oh, yeah. you know so it's just like hard for me first I don't know if other people found it to be yeah, useful so but I didn't know. Everybody was different and just isolated and lonely. Yeah. And I think if somebody's out in a, I'm the kind of person that if I'm out in the cabin alone in the woods, I'm not gonna write anything really. You yeah. Know? yeah. Just yeah. not, it just doesn't do it for me. I just grew up watching you long before Breaking Benjamin on 120 minutes, you know, it's like yeah. surreal. It's still surreal to me. Yeah. I've been doing it a long time. Things like this are surreal to me. Yesterday we played a show 
and it was uh, Mudvayne's reunion. It was only their second show, yeah. and that was a band I, before Breaking Benjamin, I loved, and I was so into. So I got to meet them, and I'm like all nervous. I go chatting those guys. Yeah. Well, I only met the drummer. Yeah. But I was still like super nervous, you know. So I still get that way. Yeah. I'm nervous now with you. Oh, on okay. the phone's different. Yeah. You know. No, but you never be nervous because uh, I'm, you know, I, I can see you a friend now. And same, a fan of your band. same. It's just you know, like we don't see. It's different when you're yeah. in the present. It is, you know? but it's, it's like nice. Bring to back the childhood memories. Yeah, I know. It's cool. I appreciate that. It really yeah, do. You know? It's awesome. You still like, man. You've been doing it since I was a kid. Yeah, and you're I still know here. Stop, and I love it. I'm very grateful. Great. You know, a lot of gratitude you have. You know what I mean? With my sobriety, with like this being alive and being healthy. Yeah, I mean, you could definitely look back on your life and be like, I did that right. Yeah. You know? Even mistakes are right. Yeah. They get us to the next place. Yeah, it's true. Like, a lot of those things ended up being, like, turns that you didn't expect them to take you to a different place. Make you into right? the person you are. Yeah, 100%. So, it was great. forgive me if I'm a little stumbly. I'm no. a little starstruck myself. No, these <laughs> girls, I mean, that's incredible. <laughs> but I love seeing you, man. Hey. You know what I mean? So, uh, I'm, I'm excited about the show tonight, man. I really appreciate you coming on here to hang with me. Cool. You know, Anytime, man. Me casa, su casa, yeah. dude. It's been Breaking Benjamin. We're in incarceration. Night two. <laughs>